What was the story, Uncle Morgan? So, His Majesty started his recollection with the words, No shit there, I'm <laughs> Now, one. That. There was a bar a while ago where I started <laughs> class, so to speak, with that, and there's a way that you need to tell her. No, no excrement there I was. <laughs> and I, of course, started with the other words, but as her grace has shown me, when children are present, you can't expound as much as you might wish to. So, but there's a certain way that you have to tell these stories. Otherwise, they do not work. They do not work. And it's really as critical. So first thing is you gash her out with a magic line. You'll be fine. No shit there I was. <laughs> and that gets everybody's attention, because now, now he's gone. Now we have a story. So it's no shit there I was. And then you have to have your antagonist. Or in some cases, your protagonist. And usually when I started, no shit there I was, dukes are badass, and all of his squires. Of course, with his majesty's no shit there I was, for the king of Norsha. <laughs> We're good. <laughs> anyway, but you have to do that, and you have to have something that you have to overcome. No shit there, I was Duke Sir Badass and all the squires, and I had a buckler and my spoon. <laughs> Not sure why, but it was a good spoon. It served me well, it didn't leak very much. It's a little spoon. In his majesty's case, no shit there, I was, and I just completely screwed up in court. Because <laughs> the king was standing there holding a sword. But you have to then, then you have to strive. This is critical key. This is where the bulk of the story usually is. This is the Dukes of Badass and all the squires, and I am at a huge disadvantage. I am not going to win this, but I am going to strive. I am going to put forth the effort. I am going to make it happen. I am going to go forth. I am going to fight that great fighter. You will not go quietly into that night. And you fight, and you strive, and you kill off the squires. You do this, you do that. And they die, and this, and now it's just you and him. But the key to a good Dukes of Badass story. It's critical, it's often overlooked and often missed. You should have to lose. Because these stories are legends and they're tales. And if all it is is you winning, and you're destroying, and wiping out, and you're overcoming odds, that's just bragging. And we've talked about that. Other people should do that. When you tell these stories, you lose because that's the lesson. The lesson is in the striving and the story, and that even though that day, Dukes are badass, lay below. I'm still here. I will be. That's the story, and that's the key to the Dukes are badass. And as you notice, His Majesty is still here. He's been sitting in the high seat at once he once begged mercy from. <laughs>